Arid Properties released their results today for the year ended September 2014. Uh, the growth in distributions was 17.9% on distributions for last year. Last year's distributions were 12.5%. Uh, the market paid 7.5% uh, last year. The market this year paid 8.5% in terms of distribution growth for the same period. And again, we were 17.9% distribution growth on, on the prior period. That's more than 100% uh, ahead of the market. Uh, Arrowhead has also produced very good core portfolio earnings, 6.9% uh, without the effects of gearing and 9.1% with the effects of gearing. The portfolio is uh, performing very satisfactorily. We've got vacancies which have reduced from 9% to 6.26%. We've got uh, set over 75% of the leases that came up for renewal during the period uh, were, were renewed. We've uh, increased our debt from 700 million to 2.3 billion. 91% of the debt is fixed. Uh, the average interest rate for the period was 8.6%. Arrowhead has uh, grown its market cap from 2.8 billion at year end last year to 5.9 billion at year end this year. The assets under management have uh, grown from 3.1 billion to 7.3 billion. Um, so there's been a huge uh, change in terms of the, the business for Arrowhead. Two major milestones that were achieved during the financial, financial year were the acquisition of 100% of Vividend as well as the acquisition of over 500 million rands worth of residential properties. Um, these, these two uh, uh, factors helped transform the Arrowhead business. Average asset size within the business um, has moved up from 17 million to, at listing to 45 million presently. And, and this indicates kind of the improved quality within the Arrowhead portfolio. In terms of prospects, Arrowhead has put out a guidance that we would look to do 11% distribution growth on, on this year. That's on the back of 12.5% last year, 17.9% this year, and then 11% to September 2015. Again, the market paid 7.5% last year, 8.5% this year, and one would expect it to pay between 75 and 9% next year. So we're clearly putting out a forecast that will be a, a ahead of the, the general market.